Okay guys, so I'm going to show you a cute little St. Patty's Day March nail style, I guess you can say. So I'm going to be using this Jamberry wrap of called Shamrockin', which is right there. I will leave this in the description bar below. This is Shamrockin', and then also using Gold Sparkle, which is nice little gold, also from Jamberry. I'll leave that in the description bar below as well. So what you're going to do, you're going to take this shamrockin you're going to put it on your pinky your index your thumb you're going to take the gold sparkle on your ring and your middle finger so as you can tell i've already prepped and pushed back all my cuticles we are going to start with our shamrockin so what i like to do is i like to roll back the edges of the wrap We'll try to at least, because, you know, these wraps can be a little bit sticky and tricky. So I like to roll it back a little bit, because I've already sized these. Remember, you want to size them first. So I like to roll it back, and then, because I have it rolled back a little bit, I'll take my scissors, and I will cut it somehow in half. So there's my half. You'll take this half and heat it for three to five seconds until it starts to look like it's flexy, which you will notice right away. So now that it's flexy, you're going to take it, apply it to your nail the best you can. Now I like to place it on my nail, but then I'm going to, whoops. First of all, you have to have the curved end at your nail, so that might help. But I also like to take the edge that I that won't be on my nail, and I like to hold it because it helps me give me a better grip on the wrap, rather than just guess it and place it down. And then I'll take my cuticle pusher, and I will gently put it on to my nail as so then I will take my mini heater again so this is how it looks now I will then take my mini heater again heat the nail with the wrap on it for three to five seconds and again use the cuticle pusher to push down and get all the wrinkles and all that jazz Try to get it the best you can. Push it down, push it down. And then with the access, I just take my little nail file and you want to go downwards away from the nail so it doesn't mess up the wrap or your nail or anything. So you just want to file down until you start to get it to look like this then you can just take the excess off unless it's stubborn like that and you can throw it away simple and then if you need to fix any edges go in with your cuticle pusher and of course fix them because it's always good to fix things and if you need to go in again for little edges and whatnot. You can either file them away or you can do what I do sometimes and just cut them off with your little scissors. Which is easier and honestly less time consuming. So there's that wrap. Now you're going to continue on with your other sizes. Now you can size them some more. And I'm going to my index finger, so which means I'll go with this one and do the same thing that you've been doing. And you're just going to continue this process for all of them. So I'm going to speed this up and I will get back to you when it's over. 
right, cool. So I have them all applied, as you can tell. So this is how it will look. Now, what I like to do to set it in, I like to take my mini heater, I like to hold my finger with the wrap on it for at least two to three seconds in front of the mini heater to let it set. One, two, three. And I take my cuticle pusher and really push the wrap onto the nail to make it adhere more to the nail. And then I take my nail, my finger, just push on it. So there's that. One, two, three. And you do that with all your fingers. And push it with your finger. One, two, three. I'll do these two at the same time. One, two, three. Push it. Push it real good. I need to stop saying I'm sorry. And then push it with my finger. Push it with my finger. Do one more time on my last finger. Push it in. Push it on. Push. And if you need to make any... Can I help you? No. Okay. And if you need to make any adjustments with your wrap, do so at the end. And, of course, you want to make sure that you don't hold anything in front of the mini heater for too long because it is it does get really hot. So there is the manicure. I will leave these in the description below so you can purchase them yourself. And yeah, so this is my St. Patty's Day look. Bye guys.